Ooh. What now? Uh. Woo! Tori was here. All right, Tori left us. All right, Tori. Ooh, to the what dog the room. fuck is that? There's a dog on it. The one with all the dogs on the dog. it. Dog. Okay, cool. So that's the one. Cool. All right, back to the dog door. The door of dogs. We must go back through this door. And back this way. And it's right on my left over here. Okay, open the damn door. I know. Uh, where's my Info. inventory? Use. Better not be anything scary in here. Probably more puzzles. This seems to be a lot of puzzles now. Okay. Oh. What is this now? Creepy as shit. This must be Tori. Hey, Tori. Oh, she's so pretty. How are you doing, Tori? Nothing I can click here? Alright. Anything I can... There's a door here. Something I can look into this corner. She's not the cutest looking girl. Ooh, a penny. A coin. Pick up. I stole a coin. <laughs> Back! Oh, We're I can so use my hints again. Bad. This is weird, man. Turn left. You didn't turn left yet. Uh, turn right. I can turn. I think it just turns me around to here. Just the right and left just turn me around. No. Oh, oh, Jesus. I don't want more pictures of you, Tori. Uh, you still haven't turned left, weird. though. I uh, know. I'm going to turn left. There's a blank picture. I know. Me. Well, there's a couple of them. No pictures oh, in them. See, it's just. That a, was weird. The music. Yeah, uh, I know. That was freaking me out, too. Okay. Uh, what did we find? A, a penny? A coin. What the fuck are we supposed to do with that? I can throw it down the vent to see how far it goes. <laughs> Let's just use the question mark. The old trusty... I guess I need a coin to go somewhere. Ugh. It's like drilling into somebody's leg. At least the question mark helps us out and tells me where to go. I don't know what I'd do without it. Because I'd honestly be lost I guess in the you're supposed sauce. to... Did I just come through that door? The one I just came through? I'm, I, I, like, these point and click games always fuck me up, because I, I think that I'm coming out facing, I think but instead I come out facing the door I came in sometimes, and, I don't know. Okay, left. Help. That's the door. Okay. Right? Right? Right. Oh, no. Click the help. Let's do this. Oh, back in there. I think we have to go back to that room. I guess I fucked up. I think we missed something. I think there's more to that. You know I'm supposed to throw something next to the fan? I yeah. think I was in there. I just came from there. Must have fucked up. Back in the dog room. I was just in here. Did I miss something? I don't want to go back in here. This room's fucking creepy. Maybe it's behind one of the paintings. Oh, it could be. I don't know. I thought I, thought I clicked anything I could click. It's probably going to tell me you have to search more in this room. Alright. To your right. I already looked. Okay, hold up. I already looked at the table. Okay, everything here. Look to your right, and that big picture frame. It's bigger than all the other ones, right there. The picture frames are kind of just random. I think. I think it's face scratched out on this one though. Photo, pick up. Let's examine this photo, shall we? It seems to be pretty. Is that the girl similar. that fucking was standing? Use? Here? You can use it? Okay, I guess not. I have to. Where am I supposed to use this? Let's examine. Can I turn it around, flip it over? No. Is that that thing that was standing oh, at us? Oh, wait. Oh. Detach the paper! Good shit, man. Let's try that. Okay, oh, that's not Jenny there. was tired of the city life. She decided to fulfill her dream. Oh, it'll take forever. Live alone in a house in the woods, outside of town. Uh, okay. Um. Uh, is where she would grow old. Okay, we're back, and also he's reading this thought. fucking paper. It's taking forever. I'm just gonna read it really quick, quickly, and so we get the gist. Even though she's terrified, she's just gonna confront him. Blah blah blah. The man was standing at the window, looking right at her. We're playing a puzzle game, and you just fucking skip through the story. I mean, you skip through the story. I know, but we we don't need that. Oh, this no, is the point question mark. Know the, the story question mark <laughs> will tell me where to go. There's a story to this game, and we're not even going to know it. We're going to beat the game and not even know the story. It doesn't matter. We don't need a story. We need to play the game. Where's the question mark? Come on, question mark. There goes the question mark. I guess we can't use it anymore? 
All right, I guess I gotta read it. I'm sorry, guys. For I can use it. Oh, I guess I can't. Jenny was Except. tired of the city life. That's cute. She decided, decided to fulfill, fulfill her dream, dream, live alone in a house in the woods outside the town. Okay, the she's, a, she's a miser. <laughs> One night really before going to sleep, Jenny town. noticed something strange outside the house. It was difficult to see because it was so dark and turned up the lamps in the room. And you could clearly see a man sitting next to the shadow. He was a gunk of grass, almost like he was observing her. Nine meters from the house. Nine meters from the house. Even though she's terrified, her, she just tried to just come front him. But once she was outside, the man was gone. He naturally assumed that he's ended up here by the chance of the spirit. Immediately, as soon as he saw that somebody was in the house, a few days later, Jenny had already begun with the man. And the main thing, Jenny keeps up some milk. Jenny Fuck that! Drinking some more milk made her sleep better. Uh, I guess she doesn't mean that. She walked around the house and took small slips of not the hot milk. She stopped on one of the windows and froze. She saw the man again. He stood about six meters from the house. Nine, six. This time you could clearly see him. He was pale and skinny. His eyes reminded me of her dolls. The empty eyes looked at her, but at the same time they didn't. She, she was about to open the window when she suddenly began walking out of the right towards the entrance of the house. She ran quickly to the kitchen and picked up a knife. She stood there frozen, waiting for the man, but he never came. A few minutes later, she went out to check if he was still there. He wasn't time by the ones again. But she started to forget the man, but at the night he felt strange somehow. All of a she was being watched. Despite the incredibly unpleasant feeling, decided to get some some needed sleep. She was trying to land in the house and noticed something in her eyes. Something that's not usual here. It was mad. I mean, one meter from the window. Nine, six. One. Jenny was so scared and screamed out loud, she ran into the bedroom. She heard the voices, but she sounded like a woman. When closed the entrance, Jenny remembered the second the chicken had seen her and always walked towards the entrance and the spirit and told free will. The thought that claimed that the children of the door slammed his opening, and she screamed as realized she had nothing to defend herself. She turned around and opened the window, jumped out of the window, and ran towards the car and parked five meters from the house. Nine, six, one, five. She was trembling from the fear and started this car and drove away and looked right at her. That's the combo to the red box we need to go unlock. Back. So there was significance in what you wanted to skip. I could have just looked at numbers. Honestly, I could have just scrolled down and looked for numbers. But yeah, I guess. Regardless, left. And that's how you speed read. All right. Never for all you college students out there that are fucking trying to figure out the rings are still not... This is it, right? Yeah. No, it's not, is it? Or is this the one where she's facing the window? No, this isn't it. Okay, cool. 9615. Yeah, never would have gotten that. Use handle. Oh, there you go. That's where the handle's for. Ah, it's all coming together now. Oh, that's not what the handle's for. Just... Oh, it literally turned the fan on. Okay. It shuts it off. Okay. That's some shitty-ass right, air right conditioning. Here. There's blood it's a Jerry on. Springer show. Envelope. Okay. Examine. A blood-stained envelope. Open. A blood-stained key. The, 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 the lock with the blood on it. Cool. Alright. Where was that? That was, a, that was a ways back. That was at the beginning. Now it's all coming together, folks. This is true escape game reality uh, ness. What? Oh, okay. Cool. Back to the bloody door, which is right here. Right here. I gotta use. I know. I, 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 okay, it's locked. Use. Yep. In we go. Oh, it's not creepy. Ah, that's not so bad. It looks like the inside of a shipping container. Why does it just fall? A sledgehammer. Head. Pick up. Let me just go into my inventory and build myself a weapon of mass destruction. Oh, not use. Combine. <laughs> no. Combine. Combine. Use. No. Okay. Cool. Well, regardless, I built a sledgehammer to defend myself. Or to break shit open. Like brick walls, perhaps. Find me. What? Find me. Up, left, left, up. Or up, left, left, up, which is the same both ways. Cool. Pick up. Let's go. Where are that brick wall? Where was that? To my left? No? It's right here? You guys remember where the brick wall was? Yes. Where? Right. In there. And it was the same room with the eyes. Where they... So... Okay. Just change the pace. I couldn't click on anything or do anything, guys. I was just literally a, sh a screenshot. What did it say on the ground? Nye? And E... G-H or something? I don't know. We should, uh... Pause it, though, real quick. Why the fuck would we do that? 
been running for 15 minutes, so you get a new intro. Oh, okay, cool. All right, we're going to make a uh, second video in a second where we're going to break through this here uh, brick wall. Okay? So stay tuned. Uh, come watch the second video. Thanks. Later. <laughs>